11 year old Ryan Parrish's first time on the pitching mound. Just strikes. And sadly, it could be his dad's last chance to watch his son play ball. Over the summer, we found out that my dad had cancer. <laughs> Ryan's dad, Gary, was diagnosed with stage four colon cancer in June. When he first got out here, he didn't have a whole lot of focus, and I, I found out why. He's got a lot more on our, his mind than we could ever have. How you doing, buddy? In August, doctors pulled 20 pounds of fluid off Gary's abdomen and stopped treatment September 1st because he wasn't responding. This is Ryan's dad, number 21. When Ryan's coach, Kaysen Wantley, found out about Gary's condition. Thank you, sir. He went to the city to get the fall rec leagues game moved up a week. So Gary could watch his son take the field one last time. We want to we want to give Ryan something to cherish for the rest of his life and and uh, this may be it. Watley says coaching Little League is more than just baseball. It's not all about the wins. It's about what you can do for that child. Give him ever everlasting memories. The type of memory that Ryan and his family will hold on to long after the bright lights on the baseball diamond. Go 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 go. Fade. Get out, Ryan! Get out! He might not be here for all of the other games, and tonight's very special because he gets to come here tonight. There you go, Ryan! You may have noticed the number 21. Ryan wore the same number his dad wore when Gary played sports as a team. The family tells me Haynes Ambulance of Alabama donated their services to transport Gary to and from the game. For Today in Alabama, Casey Drescher, WSFA 12 News.